Hello everybody, this is Akmal Angrizi Wala with you and I have with me uh, Ali Raza. Ali Raza is a kid who's uh, been learning English with me for uh, quite some time. He's gone through some lectures and I've told him about the basics of English uh, sounds. And today, though I haven't taught him about spoken English so far, but I'm engaging him in the conversation and see how does he respond. Just some question answer. Hello Ali, how are you doing? You're doing great. Thank you very much. Ali, uh, tell me about uh, what do you do? I study. You study, right? And uh, which class do you study? I study in 8th class. In 8th grade. You can say 8th grade or you can say 8th class, right? And by the way, which school do you study in? I study in Punjab Public High School. Punjab Public High, High school. school. Where is it? In Housing Colony. Oh, housing Colony Shekhupura. So it means when you study in Sh Housing Colony Shekhupura, you study, you live in Shekhupura as well? Am yes. I correct? Okay, great. And uh, what are your ambitions about your life? What do you want to become in your life? Have you ever thought about it? Not now. Not so far? What, are, what, what is that inspires you the most? Uh, an engineer, a pilot, a doctor, a liar, whoever. Are there any people who, who attract you or inspire you? Scientist. You want to be a scientist. Do you have any favorite scientist in your mind who do you think has inspired you so far? Any Elon scientist? Musk. Elon Musk. E Elon Musk. I think Elon Musk, Musk is a businessman, right? not a scientist. Yes. He's a technologist, right? He's a IT technician and professional and uh, he runs a company as well. Yes. Which company? SpaceX. SpaceX. Have you studied about SpaceX? What is it? Uh, there's a, he make uh, the rockets who goes to space and uh, come back safely. Hmm. All so, that and uh, again uh, hmm. usable. Okay, you are inspired by Elon Musk, who's a, a now uh, one of the richest people around the world. Maybe the richest top richest I right okay and uh, tell me about your brothers and sisters about your family a little bit I have three si uh, brothers and one sister mm -hmm. and uh, you are the eldest you are the youngest I or you come the in the middle youngest you are the youngest are you you are the eldest you are the eldest okay, because I'll... the rest of the guys rest of your sisters and brothers are younger than you you are the elder one all right okay and uh, do you have any friends yes who's your best friend aftab and saim aftab and saim who are they are they your your class fellows are they your street fellows class fellows they are your class fellows right and uh, are they same age with you are they senior yes, or junior same age approximately same age and same class and what do they become? Want to become? Do they want to become do, uh, scientists as well? Are they want? I don't know. You don't know? Have you ever not tried to understand or ask them who, what they want to become? No. So uh, I would give you a suggestion. Whatever you want to become, make a circle around you with the same like-minded people. You want to be a scientist? Make friends with the people who want to be a scientist. You want to be a doctor? You make friends who want to be a doctor. So when the people with the same mindset walk together, live together, eat together, play together, study together, they become, there, is, there are better chances of becoming who you want to become, right? Okay. And uh, uh, do you have any personality which do you like the most, any favorite personality? Elon Musk. Elon Musk is your favorite personality. Elon Musk is the guy you want to become. Elon Musk is the guy you study. Elon Musk is the person who inspires you. And you want to become a lay same, same technology scientist as well as you want to be a rich man? Do you want to be a rich man? Yes. Okay, right. So uh, it's been a good conversation so far. So you see uh, that uh, uh, Ali was there able to respond me all the questions. He was engaging. The best thing you can do to yourself don't worry, you're speaking good grammar or bad grammar, your accent and style or whatever, it doesn't matter, whatever it is, as far as you're able to communicate. 
if uh, the person who's putting you questions, you are able to understand what they are, what the person is saying, and you are able to respond that with a very extended language or a basic language, it's okay, no problem. The first attempt, the first achievement for anybody who is willing to uh, learn English is to get into conversation, get into question, answer and respond. No wor don't worry. We are just hesitant because we believe, okay, English might be something crazy. English might be something very strange, but it is not true. English is very simple language. It's just like Urdu Punjabi. It's very simple. You just put yourself into a conversation with some people around, engage with yourself with some people. In the start, a couple of days, you'll be hesitant. You'll, your, your uh, hands and legs will swallow, uh, but uh, will swell, right? But uh, after a couple of days, you'll be okay. You'll be wonderful. And in the start, you will have limited data, limited responses to the questions. But as long as you keep on listening English and you start engaging yourself in conversation like this, as I, Ellie and I went into some conversation and after a couple of days, maybe in a, in a week, you'll be okay. You'll be able to speak and respond the questions. And uh, I recommend you all to get yourself into conversation like this. If you find people, buddies around you, you can talk to, it's okay. You can find them on internet. Find people on internet who want to speak English and practice English with you and get engaged with them. And if you don't find any, you can connect with me on my number and uh, I'll be there to help you out. You might have my uh, number on screen. It will be here. You can connect me on that number and uh, I'll be the person to provide you the company and you can speak like Ali spoke with me, right? You saw my number on screen, you connect with me and we'll see you next time. Thank you very much. Thank you, Ali.